Hi, I'm Dr. Darren Stegall with Express Chiropractic and welcome to another Express Health Tip. In this video we're going to review stretching the calf muscles. This muscle is, is a muscle that takes a lot of abuse. It's a very dense and powerful muscle, but it definitely needs some stretching attention so that it doesn't put so much strain onto your knee and also onto your ankle, which will happen when the muscle is very tight as well as it, it can cramp up on you a lot. So we're going to work on elongating this muscle so that it's in better health. First way we're going to do it is, is to the wall. So we're going to come over to the wall and we're going to put one leg underneath us and we're going to put the other leg behind what, where we're on the toe. Now we're going to slowly let the heel drop down. You should feel the pull in the back of the calf muscle. You should feel pull or maybe a slight burn, but you should not feel pain. If you feel pain, stop the exercise and of course consult with your doctor and make sure there's nothing further going on. The second way I'm going to show you to do it is a little simpler way, but you're just going to go to your heel and you can also use a chair to stabilize you. You're going to go to your heel and now you're just going to slowly reach forward until you feel that nice pull. A third way that I'll show you, I don't have a band, but if you had an exercise band, you could sit on the floor, put the band or the belt around the, the ball of your foot or shoe and pull that toe back towards you and also get a pull. So that's three ways that you can stretch the calf muscle and please make sure that you give it the attention it deserves so that again it can be nice and elongated and healthy and not give you problems over the years. Each time you do the stretch, hold it 20 seconds, do it three times on each side and you're going to do at least one session per day and this of course is just part of your overall stretching routine that you should be doing daily. One other tip I'll give you is try to do your stretching after you've done some light cardiovascular or other type of exercise to warm the muscles up and get the oxygen and blood flowing through them. Your stretching will be much more effective with a better result if you do it that way.